Hello everyone, this is Sakola here, and in this particular video, I'm going to give you a behind the scenes look on how I create some of my videos when I especially don't want to show my face all the time. And we have those moments, we're busy, we don't want to get out of camera equipment, we don't want to have the time to press record, or be better yet, we may not be feeling our best or 100%, but there's information that we want to get out there that we want to attract our target audience's attention, so that way we can get the information into their minds and to their hearts. So I'm going to show you a software that I have been using for the past couple of years that allows me to do that. Now understand that being in front of the camera and making that authentic connection with your audience is still primarily the most important way to increase your know, like, trust factor. But sometimes you may want to switch it up a little bit. And so this is what I'm going to show you. Right now, I'm going to take you and show you the end result and then we're gonna go back and I'm gonna walk you step by step okay so just check out the few seconds of this video okay cool right so now that you've seen the end result of what it can look like for you and you may have already have some ideas popping up into your head as a business owner on different ways that I can actually do this and get information out to my target audience let me introduce you to Biddable okay so here we are at Biddable.com this is what they call the world's simplest video maker because literally you can do moving graphics or motion graphics and animation in only a few minutes so I've already shown you a brief video of what it could look like at the end all you need to do is simply sign up for a free account however just like with any free software you will have some setbacks and limitations you won't have access to everything they have to offer and of course there are watermarks that are included but I'm gonna go ahead and log in into my free account right now and I'm gonna show you the difference between the free version and the paid version okay so now we have arrived and this is what you're going to see after you first create your free account and they give you five main options so you have a way to create explainer videos advertisements presentations intros and of course slideshows but to just give you an overview of everything that they have to offer let's just go ahead and start one from scratch and then we're gonna go ahead and name our project and I'm just gonna call it sample and it's gonna give me access now over here on the left hand side of your screen you have a way to create animations and if I click on animation it is just simply patterns bears if you want something a bear theme if you ever been a fan of the Gumby show or any other type of clay animation like Thunderbirds back in the day I'm probably dating myself but you also have one called Frank I don't know what Frank is supposed to be but uh, another presentation where you can show hands moving infographics images isometrics people and signs robots and of course different types of effects and then you actually have access to certain footage and it's break broken up into different categories now here in the free version you have 233 free stock images the different other types of images that they have these are premiums and you will have to pay for these so once you pay your ninety nine dollars a year you will have access to that footage but right now we're just gonna focus on using the free stock footage and of course you're able to upload pictures so that way your picture can pop up on a screen or your logo can pop up here as well now I'm gonna show you the difference because if you pay the $99 per year you get an extra added bonus and let me show you that now okay so here I am on my paid version and it looks pretty much the same the only difference is is that here I can actually upload a video so here I can actually pick a scene for my video and it's just this one 
scene here and it's going to give me a beta view but on this particular scene I can upload a five second video I can choose for it to have audio or no audio so say for example I just want to record myself on my webcam or on my phone waving or demonstrating something I can upload up to five seconds this is something new that they have on biddable right now and it's still testing out but I've been able to actually test it out and do it in one of my videos what I have noticed is that you cannot do multiple five second videos in one biddable video so what that means is I can't do three and four different types of videos I was only able to do one five second video and create the rest of mine using stock footage hopefully that makes sense if not then type me a question below okay so here we are we're back at the free version and I'm just gonna go ahead and create some animation maybe let's take a look at some footage because I like for mine to be as realistic as possible if you're doing something for kids then I think the animation will be ideal for them so say for example I just want to create a sign that says hello how are you I'm going to choose the one with a smiley face and then I'm going to type my text in here where it tells me to scene I'm going to click the plus sign down here and then it's going to take me back to the main screen and then I want to do some more footage I'll go back to the free version and say for example I'm on vacation and I just say hey I wish you were here with me right now so let's see if we can find one where I'm on vacation I thought I just saw one oh, here we go here's someone laying on a hammock Okay, and I'm gonna do animation actually let me do an image better yet let's do people in size because this is where it's really gonna show up the color is gonna show up so say for example I want to send them a message that says have a nice day okay so now I'm gonna click save and next and then we can choose any color palettes here if you don't have any brand colors you don't have to worry about it but say for example you want to add custom colors and I want to change my background and these colors here they look great but they're not the exact colors that I need so I'm gonna click the plus sign and if you have the hex codes to your brand colors you can go ahead and incorporate those now so for me I'm gonna go ahead and type in some of my brand colors and my hex codes and we'll be right back okay so I've changed my brand colors and I did the same step like I did for the background if you choose to change the text and say for example you want to make the text darker you don't necessarily want to make it white you can choose between these four options here but for right now I'm just gonna leave it white as it is then I'm gonna go to the next step in the top right hand corner It's gonna tell me to edit my audio and then they already have an array of soundtracks here if there's a particular message or say for example you actually want to upload a track say for example you want to do a voiceover where you're actually speaking over this go ahead and record it make sure it's an mp3 file and you can upload that track as well but if you have some music say for example you're a music composer or you created your own music and you want to have it playing in the background you can do that as well so I'm gonna choose let's see what bright days ahead sounds like mm, that's not what I'm looking for how about playful beach mm, no
that sounds too soft let me get something that's more upbeat and happy let's try easy breezy hmm, I like that so let's go with that we go ahead and select it we scroll back up here to the top and next thing we're gonna do is preview the video now I'm gonna go ahead and click and say build my preview and now it's queuing up and then all we have to do is wait and you should receive an email and if you wait here a little bit longer it's gonna render the whole video and then I'm gonna come back and we'll look at the finished product okay so now we're back our video is completely rendered and we have the option to publish this video upgrade to download so unfortunately what we can do when we publish the video I'll now show you that step first but you'll have to upgrade to download it and in the download version I'm just gonna switch over and let you see when I click on my videos here I have the option to download it right here to edit it to duplicate it and to delete it but when I go to my actual video in the pro version this is what it looks like so I have these options I can also add a video in screen if I want to and give them a call to action which is what I have right here and then I can share it directly from Facebook to Twitter to YouTube and also have an embed code if I want to go ahead and embed this particular video onto my website or to a, a landing page or sales page so that is with the paid version again that's ninety nine dollars a year going back to the free version let's go ahead and check out our video and see what it looks like okay so as you can see again it has my branding color before when we were in the editing mode it was a dark purple so again choosing your branding colors or adding your branding colors it also brings brand awareness to your target audience and as you can see here it has the watermark right here and if you want to remove the watermarks again you'll have to upgrade the account but if I want to go ahead and publish my video I can do so but I won't have as many options as I had before and even if I did I can still add it into uh, a call to action at the end but everything that I have here is the same as the paid version the only difference is I won't be able to download the video directly and it is going to have that watermark at the end so all in all I hope that you have really enjoyed watching this video if you have any further questions please don't hesitate to ask if you like this video give it a thumbs up this is it this is Sakola Lair I'm signing off and again if you have any questions about video and video marketing strategies don't hesitate to contact me at the email that I'm gonna put in the description box below take care and have a wonderful day bye bye